My name is Mackenzie White and I'm an Agriculture Marketing and Inspection Representative from the Connecticut Department of Agriculture and I'm also a farmer. I wanted to talk to other service providers about the QPR training I took a couple years ago and how valuable it is for farm service providers to participate in this type of training. QPR training stands for Question, Persuade and Refer. Just like people are trained in CPR, which helps save thousands of lives each year, people trained in QPR learn how to recognize the warning signs of suicide crisis and how to question, persuade, and refer someone to help. The QPR training helps you recognize the warning signs of suicide, know how to offer hope, and how to get help and save a life. It takes about two hours to complete and can get emotional at times, but it's surprising how this topic affects more people than you'd actually think. It helps you be aware of the struggles and recognize the signs of folks that might need help. A few years ago, there was an incident in the state that shook a lot of people up and made farmers and service providers in the ag industry realize that mental health is a real thing. But we've been shying away from it. This is especially true because the perception of farmers is that we're supposed to be tough as nails and we farmers think we should just push through our problems and pull ourselves up by our bootstraps rather than ask for help. A collaborative of service providers put on the QPR training with the hope of helping farmers because they knew that people were out there and they were struggling, but they didn't know how to voice those struggles. I specifically decided to take this training because I would absolutely hate to be caught in the situation where someone needed help and I didn't know what to do. I wanted to have those tools that hopefully I would never have to use, but at least I would be ready to provide help and hope to someone if they need it. Our goal as ag service providers is to constantly be building a wonderful working relationship with farmers and when you do that well, you hopefully can notice signs of distress or if a farmer is a little off. Unless you know them, it can be hard to tell if they're stressed, joking or feeling like they're in trouble, so it's important to check in. If you do notice something, you want to be able to help them rather than just leaving that day thinking what if. In the QPR training, we learned to make it a habit to check on farmers and asking something like, how's it been going? How have you been feeling this season? I've heard you were having trouble with this crop. How's that going for you? Through the training, you learn the hard facts that suicide and people contemplating suicide is happening every day, and it's eye-opening. It's a hard topic to talk about, but if we constantly avoid it, how are we ever going to help somebody? I would suggest this training to anyone, not just ag service providers, because you never think it's going to happen to the people around you, but it can, and you can never be too prepared to help somebody. To find more info about the QPR online gatekeeper course, visit www.ctfarmstressrelief.com.